Hello, it's Jason Payne for JDP Realty Group, a coal banker, Dan Hop Realtor. Well, today I'm in the beautiful Texas Hill Country town of Bolverde, Texas, and we're in the Ventana community, which is located just off 46 and Blanco Road. I really like this community and the location because we're kind of right in between uh, Bernie, Texas and New Braunfels, Texas. Anyways, the house behind me is a model home for Texas homes. Let's go check it out. I really like a lot of things about this community. It does have a couple of good builders in it and the location is really phenomenal. If you're wanting to be in the Texas Hill Country, the Guadalupe River State Park is literally right around the corner. You got Blanco Road uh, taking you into the San Antonio area and with the expansion of 281 you're not far out from anything you want to be including some really great schools uh smith and valley is the high school that this area goes to and they're one of the top rated schools in the area anyways let's go check out this beautiful home built by texas homes now with uh, this being a model home i have to do my standard disclaimer that this has every bell and whistle texas homes can put into it um, prices in this community for Texas homes, you're pretty much looking at low fours all the way up to high fours, almost into the fives. But they have done a doozy um, fixing this up. Similar stuff is standard with like the high baseboards. But this is a beautiful home and I really like this community. This is the largest single story home that Texas Homes makes in this community. You do have the two bedrooms right up front. And if you're looking to get into one of these homes, you're probably looking at high fours, but remember they've put every bell and whistle in it. So this house probably in the low fives as it sits. We do have, this is the normally their garage, but they've got it as their office right now. It's a little mudroom spot, a little closet. It's gonna be your laundry room, good size laundry room. But yeah, there's just this uh, community, they do have plenty of lots available still and more coming up. So scarcity is definitely a problem right now. So finding a community that has stuff available is great. And I just recently found out that right down the road from us, they are going to be building another HEB when they actually start that project. And if you don't know, HEBs are a really popular grocery store. And uh, just getting word that they're going to be building one doesn't mean they're going to be building it anytime real soon. But it's nice to know it's coming. You do have a full bathroom right up front. Love the tile work that they took all the way to the top. Nice bedroom right here. And look at the size of this closet. Now we do have eight foot doors in this house. Tall ceilings. Um, they are single story plans you're gonna see anywhere between 10 foot ceilings and 12 foot. So that's kind of neat. Check out this feature that I haven't seen done before. Uh, they've got a little outdoor eating area. It's kind of neat. So now you don't necessarily have to use it as an eating space, but you can use it for setting up your own little garden boxes or something. Anything you want to do, a little outdoor play area. It's kind of neat. You just don't see that too much. A little kitchen area. I'll go check it out. Oh, that's a pretty good sized pantry. Now I know a lot of people, if the reason I came out here today is I've got clients who are buying in Bell Oaks, but if their family decided to make the smart move to come out here, this would be a perfect community for them. Great schools, lots of things to do around the area. Big, beautiful sink option in this house. So uh, yeah, getting into this community is really nice and things are just gonna keep expanding. 
they went really fancy dancy with this kitchen area or this uh, dining room area. Plenty of space in this uh, main living area. Now this community does have swimming pool, parks, and another neat feature is how they developed this community. They did it where most of the homes don't. We're right up close to 46. So you are gonna hear some road noise where these model homes are situated, but that's not typical for the rest of the community. So yeah, the yard's not super big. It does go back there quite a ways, but these houses all kind of arranged where you're not going to have someone right behind you. Of course, the loudest vehicle around comes by. But, like I said, there's other this community goes back quite a ways away from 46, so you don't have to have that road noise. It's just right up front of this community. But not having someone right behind you is a big plus. I know a lot of people really like that. This house is built on a 50 foot lot. That's why you're going to see more long versus wide in this house. Love the arches they've put in this house. And they definitely threw some bells and whistles into this bedroom. And final, this isn't actually wood. This is a really high end luxury vinyl plank. That's kind of neat. But check out this bathroom. We're gonna have one closet right here. And I believe there's another closet. Maybe not, this might be it. But yeah, this is probably it. Going back that way. Water closet, and this is a definitely an upgraded shower option. It's got the mud inset and the towel going all the way around. That's really nice. And then a his and her vanities. With the neat lights in the mirror. Love the tile work too. Anyways, I really do like Texas home. They are a semi-custom home. So if you're building a house from dirt and you want to make some changes, like, hey, you wish this wall was a little bit different, you can pay for making that change because it's going to be, you're going to have to pay the cost of doing it because they don't want you to make a whole bunch of changes and then last second decide, oh, I don't really like this house, I'm out. And then the builder stuck with the house. That's kind of weird because you had weird things you wanted to change. So that's why they want those deposits up front. But it is a neat option to have. And in today's environment, a lot of builders aren't given that option to make any changes anymore. So if you want to do a little tweaks, uh, Texas Homes is a great option to be able to do that. And it is nice having this little office and the little outdoor space. All right, that's going to wrap up a tour of this model home in Ventana subdivision in Boverde, Texas, right off of 46 and Blanco. So if you're looking for more information on this community, feel free to reach out to me. I'm a real estate agent trying to grow my business and these videos are definitely helping. I appreciate it. So of course, if you like this video, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. And as always, keep sharing these videos with your friends and family. All right, talk to you soon. Take care now.